Thanks again for babysitting our daughter, Mike. No problem. Hey, can you babysit her at night? Why? Well, we want to have a night together. Sorry, uh, I can't. I have a night shift. Then take her with you. Are you crazy? Who knows what the animatronics would do to her? Don't take her into place. She can sleep in your car. I don't know. What's in it for me? We'll pay you a hundred bucks. Okay, you have a deal. Thanks, man. Oh, and here's some money for McDonald's for her. Okay. Okay, see you at night. Bye, Uncle Jack. See ya. Hello? Hey, Jax. I just have a question. Did you lock the door when you leave? Yeah? Why you ask? Because someone broke into this pizzeria and they didn't come back. There are two boys, one girl, one boy has white hair and red jacket and a girl who has brown hair or darker and one man has sunglasses and speed rushing. Those red cash gang. Hello? How did they break in? I don't know. Listen, just talk to me after your night shift. I gotta go. No clue, sir. Welcome to McDonald's. What do you want? Can I have a happy meal? Cheeseburger one or chicken nugget? Chicken nugget one with a girl toy. Okay, is that all? That's all. Do you always have to yell? What? Do you have a problem with it? Uh, nope. Okay, Tiffany, you sleep in the back seat while I work. Your pillow and blanket and phone is in your bag so you can go watch something, but do not leave the car. Okay, the window is open, so good night, Tiffany. Good night, Uncle Jack. Hello, hello. Hey, you're doing great, man. Uh, so most of the night guards don't even last this long. You know, I've been actually questioning about that. Uh, when they were when they were missing, we tried searching the place up, but for some reason they were actually not even they're not even there. Um, enough about that. Um, you have only um two animatronics to deal with, so let's tell you the first one. <laughs> well, Madden on the stage, like he doesn't even leave his stage very often. I mean, you could you could be lucky if he, if he like you could be lucky if he doesn't uh, uh, get active at like 3 a.m. But if he does, then I'll t then I'll tell you what to do with him. Okay, so basically he laughs to where he moves. That means he lets you. That means he lets you know where he is. He likes playing games though. He ain't he in uh, yeah. You don't expect his games though. He could be skipping. Uh, any hallways, you can like just run and just stand. And once you hear a big laugh at your uh, right door, that means he's there. So might as well just close it before turning on the light. Because you obviously know that he's already there. But if you uh, did turn on the light when he's there, then you're instantly dead. So yeah, you just might as well just close the door. Don't even look at, the, don't even look at it. Now the other character, I think, uh, I think he was the one that, uh, li that were, I think he's, uh, he's in this, like, room that the children are not allowed to go in. I think it was called, uh, Parts and Service. Well, my, well no, it could not be Parts, it could not be Parts and Service, is it? No, it ain't, no, it ain't. Okay, um, I don't know what you call it, it's just like a basement or something, kind of almost looks like the basement, it, and that animatronics is just laying there, all broken. That one, uh, we usually call, uh, well, I didn't call him, but the workers of this usually calls him Madden.exe. Um, and I was, and I, and after when I keep hearing about this, I guess I should name him Madden.exe. But it was actually, it was, his real name was Madden, because, uh, because his early 90s, uh, because the early 90s, well, not the early 90s, um, well, on 1997, 1997, um, there, there was a restaurant called Madden and Henry's Family Diner, 
And they were all just having fun. These kids are just running around, enjoying the band. There's only just two animatronics, though. And on, but yeah, this, but uh, yeah, there's something that caused the the cut of the um, uh, the cut of '97. Yeah. Anyways, um, he uh, and I and like we saw him uh, broken and stuff. He was like laying down on the ground, all broken, and we don't even know what happened to him. We could have just like, yeah, he could have malfunctioned in there, but he was quite dangerous then. But now, in this place, he's very dangerous. So in order to avoid him, I'll tell you this: uh, he usually goes to your left door, and I'm not sure if like. Uh, Leaving your door closed while he's still here doesn't make him leave. Um, if he's still, if for some reason he's still there at your door and he doesn't really leave, uh, just press the sound button and his, uh, like, okay, so if I were, so if I were to say, uh, he's looking at cameras, you'll see, like, uh, then you, like, click, click, right click twice, and, yeah, it just makes the sound of an innocent kid laughing. So that means he will come back, he'll come back to it. Also, fair warning, uh, that could still cause your power. That could still cause your power. Um, just only one, just only one loose of power, and that's it. So, just don't use it all the time. Speaking of the power, um, once you, uh, once you waste power and Madden comes out, there's no way of avoiding him. You're just gonna have to make, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to, like, put fingers crossed or something, I don't know. Uh, but anyways, I hope nothing, I hope nothing's gonna be going hard for you, uh, Talk to you soon. Or, yeah, no, no. Talk to you tomorrow. Oh, wait, one more thing. Um, some reason the arcade machine are just, um, uh, just, uh, not working for some reason. So, you think you might be the maintenance guy, or you maybe could be engineering. I, I don't know. But just, can you try to fix the arcade or something? That'd be great. Thank you, and have a good night. I knew it. He is Madden from Madden and Henry Fun Day. But they name him Madden.exe? Very creepy. Henry, why the long face? People are mean to me. They call me ugly and stupid. Well, I don't find you ugly and stupid. You don't? Of course not. You're perfect just the way you are. And don't listen to these bullies. They don't know what they're saying. But what if I am? I would still be friends with you no matter what. Really? Really. And I have a song just for you. Aw, thank you. You ever hear peep? Well, this is kind of nice. Okay, that's it. I'm getting a chair. But I'm supposed to keep this music box wind up. Well, I gave you a beating. Now don't leave or else you get bullet nail cancer. 
Well, there ain't no chairs around, so this is the final room. Ah, yes, there it is. Super Team Camaro's body to keep the music box running up. Speaking of the devil. Oh god, what did the man say about Madden.exe? Wait, I remember now. Okay, I think they're gone. Thank God they didn't find me. Uh, what's that sound? Oh god, the music box! <laughs> Finally, 6 a.m. I almost died. What's this doing here? So, they want me to fix this?
Okay, now that I take Tiffany back to her parents' house, I can watch another VHS tape. And welcome back to the interview. Hello, sir, what's your name? Hello, I'm Ad Hello, I'm Madden. Nice pleasure to meet you, dude. Nice to meet you, too. So I've heard you've been make selling skulls? Yes. Yes, many people have uh, gone to my store where they can buy uh, skulls. They're not actually real skulls, though. I put them on hats, put them on decorations. Yeah. I see. So you use any real skulls? We usually find uh, real animal skulls, and um, yet uh, they are. Um, yeah, they, yeah, they're still actually pretty good. They got they one got big. They got big ones because we got uh, moose skull. Any type of animal skulls, it's, it can be any type of bones, like, uh, like any. Interesting. So what else do you make? I have made, um, I have made skull glass. I do, this is where I pour myself a favorite drink. That I just, yeah. So what was the item that made you rich? The most sold ones was this. It's the, uh, it's a walking, it's a walking, um, Basically, I um. So I just I just basically I try to make the um metal pulp and then like. This one is actually freaking hard. Like here, feel it. Whoa, it is hard. See, I told you, man. Yeah, this one is like so hard, and it could be like um. Yes, yeah. Make sure you don't make sure you don't swing that around around people, because otherwise they can cause them um. um Injuries like broken bones, concussion. Um, yes, that's basically the most uh, warning part. Do not um, swing this around. I'm also upon. I'm also thinking like if I should make like uh, if I'm like an engine, if I'm a scientist, I could usually uh, make turn this like uh, metal skull cane to like something like something else like light up. Um. Let's you cute, but that ain't never gonna happen because I could tell like so basically like when I was a little kid I've been like uh been tricked all the time by like that metal got metal gun every time I pull the trigger it just like lights up but then instead of that I just uh it just uh like uh um it just zaps me but I'm not gonna be able to I'm not gonna do that as well because I don't not like that as as much not gonna lie um but yeah what else do you do for days what else am I doing for my uh, day. Um, I'm just making money. I'm just making money. Uh, plenty of money, actually. The golden ones are just, uh, the most, uh, the most wanted ones. They just only cost, like, uh, 500 bucks. The gold skull costs 500 bucks? Mm hmm yes. I see. So, what else do you usually make? What else do I usually make? Um, any type of, like, uh, holiday skulls. Like, um, St. Patrick's Day, 4th of July, um... Easter ones and um, um, Easter ones and uh, some some uh, Christmas ones and Halloween ones and oh, whoops. Yes, I make like, any type of holiday ones, birthdays. Um, you name it, you name it. What would you do if your business got shut down? What would happen? What would I do if my business got shut down? I would not like that. Well, haven't you heard of Madden's Pizzeria? It got pretty good there. The Madden's Pizzeria is actually getting opened. Well, yes, it's been opened and it's been making plenty of money. It, it's getting pretty famous, right? Yes, it is. Uh, well, as long as it doesn't, uh, as long as it doesn't uh, shut down my store, I will be happy. Like, I, w I will still let the children, I will still let the children have fun in that place, but I just do not want my um business shut down because like some somehow like a couple of days ago no one's like some barely even people there yeah um okay you'll let the still kids have fun at the place but now is that it no yeah that, that's it that's it that's all that happened that's all happened so what else would you do if your business got shut down something else i would do yes 
Um, like, something very bad? Well, I guess, I guess. Oh. Um, this is like, I'm actually going, well, I will do something, but I'm, but I'm, that's not mean I'm actually going to do it. And what would that be? Walking people's heads, 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 heads. <laughs> yes. But you know that's actually not gonna happen. Because, um. I, bet, I think my store will never, like, never, ever, ever, uh. be shut down. Well, I guess that's all, sir. Thank you for interviewing me. No problem. And the ones who watch, and the one who's watching this. Go to Skull Chest and buy one of my merchandise. Please. I want the money. I'm not like Mr. Krabs, but, but, thank, but, but still, thank you for interviewing me. Well, you're welcome. Now, is there anything else we want to say to them? Thank you. And I hope my store doesn't get shut down. <laughs> Hello? Hey, hey, slow down. What's going on with Tiffany? William, calm down. I'm on my way. Hi, neighbor. I am here. How's Tiffany doing? Well, no nurse has told us how she is yet, but how did this happen? Well, she is not in the place and I have had my window open and so she doesn't have heat stroke. Oh, well, she's K, but she's talking weird. Go see your parents. She talks weird? Yes. Like, how weird? Oh, well, she's just talking about creepy stuff. Hey. What do you want? Well, I work at the pizzeria called Madden's Pizzeria, and I was looking forward to know more about this place, and my buddy William has told me at the older place, that place is a circus one. Well, your friend ain't wrong. It did happen. Was the animatronics dangerous? Well, not really. They were pretty kind to my daughter. And yet, my daughter went missing and never came back. I miss her so much. Who was your daughter? That's your daughter? Yes. And who's that animatronic? His name is Clowny. Just only one? No, there's more animatronics that got working for some reason. What's her name? Olivia. So, how was work? It has gone tough, yet tired. I also saw you running. Is that what you do in the morning? No, I run to the hospital because William told me her daughter is not waking up and not breathing. Is she okay now? Yeah, she is. I have a question for you. What do you do on day shift making kids happy and have fun and how I dress up as a mascot of Henry that yellow one Henry, Henry. Henry. I remember I seeing that, that in the driver room, 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 room or something when I was getting a chair you okay yep I'm fine 